Yeah, yeah, we laughing at stuff on Poshmark. Bad starting on Poshmark. I'll leave it below. My whole family has one. Mine, Suge, and Bay. If you got kids, you know, Bay wear men clothes. But we laughing because people be putting shit like this on her for, well, them just 60 but like $100. I'm mailing packages. I'm working on my giveaway winner package from the last vlog. And I do my giveaways on Twitter now. So if you're watching this, go over to my Twitter. Follow me. If you're already following me, like the post. It's going to be a giveaway up. So, um, yeah. I figured I could do this part today because I got to go to the post office. Lord, and I got some videos to record, so let me go and get this out the way today. I'm feeling okay today, huh, babe? I got a little woozy, but I needed some on my stomach before that medicine kicked in. I start feeling like my stomach started warming, and I start feeling like hot and stuff, but I ate some crackers. So, yeah. I'm also doing my expenses as I package. Cause I'm like three days behind. Y'all know I gotta do these every day. Keep up, keep up. By the way, this is the budget planner I use. I will link it below. And I got the one that come with the workbook in the pocket. Um, let me just show y'all. I hate when I do that. It come with everything with the dividers, and then at the back it's even a little bag for your receipts. Let me, see, so, let me show y'all what I got from. Amazon. I still have a couple of orders to package. Y'all stuff ain't on the floor. It's in bags. And um, yeah, let me show y'all. I have to order me some more if you watch my shower with me routine. I hope it's up by now. <laughs> I ordered some more of these body exponents. I will leave the link below. I ordered three, but you know my little broke bestie gets hooked up too. Per. And so here's some orders and some more Poshmark orders. But I have to go up to the warehouse in a minute, so let me get off this phone. I'm trying not to lose any more weight on this treatment, so I've been eating a lot of crackers, bread, potatoes, grits. <laughs> Ooh, this is a horrible view. Okay. A little better. Got a new scent. <laughs> you got your own channel, boo. Why you over here? It's many times you done answer the video that I have to cut out. Well, girl, you be cutting me out. Yeah, like, uh -uh, cut that out. Because I be naked half the time. <laughs> I just go home in any kind of way. Oh, okay, shoot. If you ain't, you know, it's just, it's just a fat roll. Okay, just fat roll. Okay, so. Y'all having a hard time opening these. Not because my nails are long, but because it's time for me to get a feel. And they are all pulling up. <sighs> Golly, look at this little tiny thing for... Eighty million dollars. Hold on. Okay, that's working with little shum. Work with little shum shum. I smell powder. I smell a little some kind of mint. Tobacco. Watch out all the way out. Let me look up the house a little bit. But baby, sis was all the way wrong with the notes. <laughs> I, uh, all the way. <laughs> I need to go back to perfume school. My, my nose off or something. Because baby, get this. It smells delicious. Ooh, that smells so good to me. I'm back. That's your Valentine's You better not buy another the same thing. For you to wear girl what you gonna do if i put this on <laughs> hola, hola. <That's> <laughs> i'm so fucking pissed i'm at the warehouse by the way last night nicole was trying to put some air in a fucking inflatable chair i don't know why she even need that fucking chair and she got my pump out of my truck well her smart ass used the wrong end and it was fix a flat and it splattered everywhere and it literally got all over my brand new ass car she gonna act like she got it all i'm not understanding because i just went outside and i still see the residue all over my car but she went washed her car today baby we done fussed the whole way here like it's been forever since i've been in here 
Suge and Nicole been coming to work for me. Baby, the girl was down. The Suge knows she be working. Love my little baby. Girl says she ain't gonna let us feel. Uh, let's see. Y'all, why are y'all not buying these? I got so, oh, actually that's all I have left. I have so many of them and they're so cute. The um, Nikki's in black. Look at that. Snooze you lose. <laughs> Let me stop. If you haven't watched last week's vlog, I'll link it right here, but I'm doing treatment for H. pylori. I'm actually on week three of it. I mean, ooh, I'm on week two. No, I'm on day six of 14. Here come this dang demon. Show the camera, show the camera your face. I'm trying to mess up my car. I got it all, I got it all. I can just slap the shit out of you right now. Y'all, God damn. I don't care what you do on my back, because little mama, you won't swing. You won't swing. Put that shirt in the bag while you're standing there looking goofy like you are. So mind the business that pays you. Baby, that's exactly what the fuck I'm doing. <laughs> you must have forgot. The owner, CEO. Hell, she thinks she's talking to me. Stop, boy. I was trying to get that off my hand. You see me? Yeah, come get your girl. She ain't gonna try to play me too much longer. They put me some stands together while I was sick. Huh, sure. How sweet of them. They for next door. I know what I meant to tell y'all. Y'all. Oh, did I say this on my other vlog? I've been so out of it. When I show y'all stuff, I know it's a little bit confusing because I show y'all authentic and I show y'all dupes. But don't assume stuff dupes because like for my birthday haul, damn why I keep saying birthday, Christmas haul, one of you guys asked me for the Tiffany & Co. site. That's a real baby. <laughs> All them Tiffany & Co. pieces was from Tiffany & Co. Um, I guess in my hauls I need to start clarifying that. Um, but i think i do a good job but still people are getting confused because i i have no problem saying this is a dupe or i got this from my home girl otherwise i say i got it from the store you know what i'm saying oh gotta go all right guys today i'm eating i'm gonna drop it oh did drop it oh i got a banana i'm gonna record a what i eat in a day video tomorrow i just honestly it's been a lot going on so What I eat in a day is just one meal. I mean, you know, one meal per sitting. So what I might do is like show you guys two different things for each thing. So instead of just showing y'all oatmeal and bananas is what I eat for breakfast, I'll show y'all oatmeal and bananas along with something I might eat another day. Lunch, instead of just showing y'all a wrap, <coughs> I'll show y'all something else I might eat another day. So it's like options. Only going to be like two options because I ain't wasting no food, honey. She ain't doing that. Um, and if I make all that stuff, I'm not going to eat all that stuff. So, <laughs> um, yeah. But, yeah. I'm clean. Um, clean eating over here. Island does just like if you're on a diet. I have a cheat day, or island does indulge in certain stuff, but I don't eat a lot of it. Like all them times I went to True Kitchen, I literally just taste it to see how it tastes. Then I wrap it up to go. So yeah, it's coming. Oh, oh, here's the thing. Nicole went back to work today. She went back to school today. Last night, I was up at 7 o'clock in the morning because my stomach was hurting so bad. So, I had to order some probiotics from Amazon because 
Ba -ba -ba. I can't drink that kum kumbachi, whatever that stuff called. And baby, -ba -ba, I can't I can't um eat that yogurt. It's just disgusting to me. That's just my opinion. Today I finish week one. One more week to go, y'all. I'm grilled over here. <laughs> And I've started drinking back, drinking an antioxidants water. This shit is just high, like fifty dollars a case. So yeah. I've made a lot of lifestyle changes. I don't eat candy. I don't drink soda. Nothing but ginger ale and water is all I drink, basically. Um, my whole diet has changed. They can attest to that. This is what I forgot to tell y'all about my treatment. I've done probably two videos on this. Um, but the antibiotics tends to create a lot, a lot of yeast because it pulls out your, um, good bacteria. And so your body don't have anything to fight, um, yeast. I hope I'm saying that right. I know somebody will correct me in the comments. So if you are a female and you are being treated for H. pylori, I've been saying re, but it's the same damn thing. Make sure you have your doctors call you in. Make sure my information not on here. Um, basically, what it's called a diflucan. I think this is the generic brand. It's a little pink pill. You can either do the seven day cream. Don't do any of the instants. You can do the seven day cream. The creams never works for me. The creams with. I get through with the seven day yeast treatment and then from all that cream and stuff being up there, it will turn straight into a bacterial infection. It would be the weirdest shit ever. So I was so glad when they came out with these pills. But anyway, do not take the pill while you're on the treatment. Do not. Even if even even if you start itching and stuff, you just gonna have to go get the cream. Because no, just don't. You wait till after the treatment, then take the pill. And I'm guarantee you, your ass gonna be itching. So don't wait and try to see if you're going to start itching to where it get real, real bad and you about to die down there. Um, Just go ahead and tell your doctor to call you in when they call you in the triple treatment. Excuse how I look. I act like I just can't take a comb or brush to my hair sometimes. But then my glasses like so, it's, it's open. Girl, the post, yeah, the post office line is out the door. So make sure you get them all sugar and then I'll fall out. So, I didn't think uh, y'all was going to get y'all packages today. Like, what is going on? Okay, she got them all. Big shoes. So she know how to work. I'm going to do my hair tonight. How many times I've been saying I'm going to do my hair? She tried on my situation. And I got indigestion today. I was doing good. Day seven. <sighs> Stomach hurt all last night. I think I told y'all at 7 o'clock in the morning. Whew. Bows was trying to move, I guess. Seven more days to go. After tonight, after I take my pills tonight, I'm going to refill that purple container and pray for this countdown. Pray in Jesus' name I am healed and this is it. Baby, because I'm tired. Little tells y'all, look, frankly, it's your grandma. Come this way, boy. Come this way. Come on. Okay, I'm trying to get it. Why he be under the rock? It's your grandma Frank. Hey! I'm gonna teach y'all how to train turtles. Y'all probably like for what? I don't know who has a turtle with y'all. It's your grandma Frank Frank. Uh oh, hold on. I gotta make sure you don't bite me. <laughs> get it out of my nail. There you go. My baby wouldn't even eat for a whole month. Look at him now. Get your food. Little aggressive thing. Where he at? Too big for him. He didn't make it happen. Use them hands. There you go. Let me see you grandma over here. So I'm trying to eat. about a tank, y'all. Gotta stay sanitized. <laughs> Ain't no more food, frankly, going on. <laughs> Gotta stay sanitized. Or wash your hands before and after. 
just in case my little grandbaby carries salmonella. I don't have no more food. You're too fat. All right, guys, we are on week two. And guess what? Walmart left five of my, I took my nails off last night. Five of my, um, Moccasillons out. Um, I got this. It's another blue gym, a budget item. Ooh, I got this for myself for Valentine's Day, but it's the black on the go. This purse, $3,900 on the Louis Vuitton website. Ooh, platinum got it, but she ain't got it like that. My friends showed this the other night. I was like, Panda here. Only thing, only thing, only thing, because y'all know I know my luxury. I don't give a damn how much bootleg I buy. I don't play around with the real thing either. And that's, this purse is supposed to be orange in the inside if it's real. Yeah. Oh, she put some, something else up in him. Hold up, friend. Friend, what else is up in here? I need to start doing it. If you guys haven't noticed, I do that a lot. Never look inside my stuff and there'll be stuff in there. But that's my biggest pet peeve about bootlegs. Like, if you're going to knock it, knock it. <laughs> Whoa, like this is different. The interior is just different, but some bootlegs the design don't even make. So, but I did get a lot of real stuff for um Valentine's Day. So I'll show y'all that Valentine's Day haul. If I do one, I might not do one. I might just put what I got for Valentine's Day in a vlog, depending on how much stuff I get. Um, but she sent me earrings. Here's one of those ear things. Y'all gonna see this again if I do Valentine's Day. How about I just do this? And she sent me a lot of designer earrings. <laughs> I just picked up the meds they left out. I don't know how the fuck a pharmacy do that. And then, it, you know what? Woo! Shy! Because I just need to learn how to be positive. But some stuff I don't understand because y'all know I hate touching that thing. Like, I feel like everybody who got corona and come through this mug and get pills got to touch that case. Now, maybe they sanitizing it in the inside. I don't know. But that just creeps me out. And how do you leave somebody medicine out? Oh, my warmth coming back. I had got so damn yellow and pale looking. Um, I'm glad it wasn't like a... um. I don't know the technical name, but like a pain pill or something for they think I'm, you know, trying to get over because they, you know, they think we always want pain meds. Let me get off of this motherfucker. Hey guys, it's the queen of explaining herself. I just wanted to drop in real quick and let y'all know that if I don't respond to one of y'all comments, I don't pick and choose who I come in under. I've seen a lot of people here re recently saying, hey, will you respond to me? Hey, you you don't ever respond to me. And the thing is, this is my, my method in my head so I don't overwhelm myself. If I drop a video today at 3 o'clock, about 10, 11 o'clock at night, I'll go respond to all them comments. After that night, I don't go back. <laughs> so if you left the comment after I responded, yeah, I might not respond unless it's a question because... I don't know. It's just, it stops me from having to work so hard. I will get better at that. But yeah, what I do is like I drop the, my vlog at five. When I can't sleep in the middle of the night at like 12, I rewatch the vlog and sit there and answer all the comments that people have left. The next day I'm on to another project. So it's not personal. It's just, it just stops me from having to do so much work. By the way, I did go to my P.O. box, but I was on the phone. So, I couldn't record it, but I got a lot of stuff. So, let me put my bundle on because, girl, y'all know I'll be going around my little plaits in my head. And um, I'll go up in here and show y'all. Baby, it's a lot. It's a lot. All right, now let's get to it. <laughs> See, y'all, I did even better, even though this look a mess. I said I was going to put on a bunny, then girl, I slept on a... I look, yeah, I tell y'all all the time, this little makeup dog wig, I just threw it on. This thing ain't tangled, shedded or nothing. I haven't, I haven't curled it. I'm going to get me buy two more from her because the hair quality itself is gorgeous. Sorry, girl, dropped the phone. But I got to get a couple of more because I think this one is only two bundles in a, 
uh, um, closure and I needed a little bit more voila. But this is like a little cute everyday thong type wig. I got to My skin is so dry. Baby, y'all know I ain't never had no dry skin, so let's go. Amazon. I got some good probiotics on left for my nails, y'all. Took them off. They look a mess. I put some press-ons tonight. These are the adult probiotic gummy strawberry flavor. They are very extremely good. And I got these because um they got five stars on Amazon. It, do you know how hard it is to get five stars? That means everybody who buy them gotta like them. And it was a lot of reviews and it five stars. Yeah. Add to cart. Okay, so this right here came from 101 eyelashes. So this is the packaging. Let me cover her address because this is my P.O. box. Very cute pink packaging. I'm doing an unboxing with no scissors. Well, I ain't got nails. Oh, nah, I can't do this. Hold on. Guys, so there's a thank you card in here. Let's see what it say. Hey, 101 Lash Doll, I appreciate you taking the time to check out my product. Enjoy Hot Maintenance 1989 Eyelashes. 101 Eyelashes is what it say on here. And I got two styles. This is H. H. Main. H. Man. High maintenance. This is high maintenance. And are both of them high? And this is 1989. Exactly what the paper just said, Nikki. Girl, get with it. So, this is the packaging right here. So, here is 1989. Light and fluffy. And then here is high maintenance. This is high maintenance. So, let's put them up against each other. Thank you so much for my lashes, boo. You can never have too many lashes. $19.99 to the right. Oh, is it y'all right? This $19.99. Okay. So this actually came in today, but it is from Bay. I mean, it is for Bay. So if you ever want like that soul feel, name, necklace, picture necklace type stuff and want it in two, three days, go this route. So one of her last pictures with her dad. When we went for my birthday. <sighs> All right, sorry guys. Um, this is from Shiny G's. Shiny G's. Sorry if I'm butchering it. Came in this envelope like this. It was wrapped like this. Chinese custom cases. Case. <laughs> I think she sent me this. And I just asked Bay. Bay could be my witness. I just told Bay yesterday, somebody sent me this deal with this phone case and I ain't never get it. And here it is today. <laughs> here is the card right here. You guys know you don't have to worry about screenshotting. I'm just showing y'all how the presentation look. I always put everybody information below and look at my case. Oh, it even got my name right here. Oh my gosh. Queen Periana. Okay. The LV lips, the per oh, this is so cute. This is so cute. Let me see. Uh oh. I don't know. I got my the wrong. Oh. That's beautiful. Okay, sis, thank you so much. Please look her up. That's going on my phone right now. I mean, after I get through showing y'all this stuff. Let me just go and follow her so I don't forget who to tag. So, I got my phone ringing off the chain. I got this box from Derma E. Um, hey, Derma E. <laughs> they going to take care of me. You hear me? This is detox and de-stress. <laughs> Period. Because, girl. Girl. Girl, girl, you know you need to de-stress. All right, so here's the packaging right here. Oh, I need them crinkly papers. Look, my phone is actually sitting on a box of crinkly paper I just got from Amazon because I told you guys my small business hack of the week and I still ran out taking them out of other packages. Hold on. This is what I got my phone sitting on, a big box of it. And then there's more in this Dermot E box. Back to our regular schedule program. So they sent... Purifying gel cleanser. No, we ain't doing that. And we ain't on the camera. There we go. They sent the little tool you use to apply facial products. They sent 
Purifying Daily Detox Scrub. And they also sent the Purifying 2-in-1 Charcoal Mask. So that's what the um, little applicator is for, is the charcoal mask. Very inexpensive. I almost said hair care line. Baby, it is skincare. Oh, they got hair care too, but that ain't what that was. So thank you so much, Derma E. Sparkle and grind. Oh, who is sparkle and grind? <laughs> okay. Girl, I came with these little baby kitty nails. Baby, they look, they look grandma nails. How I open this sparkle and shine? My videos be so long. Playing. Playing all the damn time. Oh, this is some good tape. God dang. Hold up. I don't want the phone to buy. No, I'm a little weak right now. <sighs> Sister said, ain't nobody getting in this for platinum. Okay. Baby. Bust it. Bust it. I don't know what it is, so you guys are gonna open it up with me. Oh, we got some old crinkle paper. Okay, girl, I'm reusing your stuff. <laughs> There's a that's a metal straw and a cleaner. Y'all know I, I'm oh okay. Let me read the card first. Slow down, clown. Slow down. <laughs> Sparkle and Grind. It say, hey girl, love all your videos and business tips. I made this tumbler for you. I hope you like it because purple is my favorite color too. By the way, oh, I already told y'all, follow my purple Instagram. Um, please share and check out my website for all your bling, supplies, and more. And yes, I do make custom cups tumbler as well. Blessings to you and your family. IG at Sparkle and Grind. Sparkleandgrind.com. Okay, let me follow her right now before I forget. Hold on. Now we can get back to our regular schedule program. Y'all wasn't going to tell me we was following. Okay, so. Sparkling ground sticker right there. Make sure ain't nothing that's in a box because, baby, I'm infamous for... I'm infamous for the video being over and I'm finding stuff. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, it is. This is so neat. What's on the inside? Oh my gosh. It might look a little blue, but trust, sis, it's purple. And look at this together. Thank you so much. I love it. I love it. I didn't expect this. I love everything people seeing, but I had no idea. This Like, a lot of people write me and say, hey, can I send you... Or they'll send it and say, hey, this is on the way to you. But I had no idea. So I didn't know what to pull out this box. Beautiful. Oh, I got a lot of paper to take up to the salon. Warehouse. <laughs> um, Pop sent over pucker up patches for your lips. Hydro lip patches. They been coming through lately. Plout pump. Volume gloss. And something else in here. Um, permanent pout. It's a liquid lipstick. I don't like opening this because I might like put it in giveaways because I have so much makeup that's not getting used now. So yeah, check Pop Beauty out. And then I got another box. Young Living Essential Oils. I think I know what this is. One of you guys sent me something to take for my guts. Yep, that's exactly what this is. It is called Multivitamin Supplement. Promotes a positive outlook and outlook and healthy support. Normal cardiovascular health. And that's what they look like right there. 
So thank you so much. So many of you guys have been exceptionally helpful during this process and I really appreciate it. So yeah, I thought I had more stuff, but this is like, this is like a contour beam. Okay, here we go with this brain shit. This just looked like a Contour Me by Nikki um, package that was sent back. I sent them out the wrong color leggings. Yeah, thank you. Because I sent somebody the wrong thing one time and I still ain't got my shit back. I even sent them a return label to send it back. I don't know what that's about. I got your address, huh? <laughs> don't forget I'm a goon. Nah, but for real. It's too... Standard navy leggings. Yeah. Morning. So I'm never up this early, guys. The school hit us 20 minutes before school started and said the whole cafeteria is on quarantine. And don't bring your kids to school unless you send food. <laughs> Whoa, this this is just insane. Um, so I should have stayed home. Um, yeah. And then they call back like an hour later after school started. I guess parents panicked and said that they'll be pr providing sack lunches today and the rest of the week they'll figure out a meal plan. So somebody in the kitchen has been dealing with these kids' food with their virus. It, it's the craziest shit ever. And I would have just kept school, should homeschooling. But um, she has to go to eighth period anyway, which is track practice. So if you're going to have to be around kids anyway, might as well go to regular school. Like she has to go. That's like part of her grade. So it's just wild right now. Then I've just been sitting up here and I'm thinking, you know, I have been documenting me being sick. But I think after I get well. There, there's either two options, guys, and I've I've expressed this before. Um, the only reason why I haven't done it is because so many of you guys do enjoy the vlogs and love me genuinely. You got the the little corner that really don't like me but can't stop watching. So, um, more of me saying it was I'm either gonna just stop the vlogs, <laughs> or I'm gonna just take our personal matters out of them because. It's like, um, I've mentioned how I expressed what going on in my house before, okay? And see, this is why a lot of YouTubers don't like to open up. And somebody left a comment under my last vlog and was like, I criticized that girl. I'm assuming they mean Nicole, who's not a girl. She's a grown-ass woman. In every video... Um, and you know, I look back and I do. Okay. But let's clarify some things. Criticizing her in every video. I have been frustrated in every vlog for like the past 10 months because I've been fighting the illness and I didn't know about it. So I'm very irritable. I'm very, um, short tempered. So if I'm somewhere in I'm working late at night by myself, sick in the colors at the house. And I say that. The first thing you guys rip off and say in the comments is, why is Nicole not helping? Where is Nicole? Why is she at the house? Where Y'all can ask it, but when I say it out of frustration, I'm criticizing her. You get what I'm saying? So if I say I'm up here working, Nicole's just at the house watching TV. Y'all take that as I'm criticizing her, but that's my truth. That's what's really going on. So I understand how that can project really mean, really mean, and like I am criticizing her all the time, but that is my truth. What y'all want me to come on here lying saying, oh, she's right here packing. That's not happening. I can't lie about that. You know, not criticizing her, but that's my truth. Like when I said Nicole isn't nurturing, that doesn't mean she does not care. That's just her character. She, do she doesn't cater like I do. That's not criticizing her. That's my truth. So maybe that's my problem. <laughs> I should just mention her at all in my vlogs. Boom. Everything is soft. All right, guys. We are on day seven. We're on day 10. Y'all, let me tell y'all. The nauseous has went away. 
I'm sorry, my I'm like real dusty. My face is dry, got bags, not bags, dark circles around my eye. I'm breaking out tremendously. Anyway. Um about okay, what was I saying? The nauseous and stuff. Not and stuff. Not, I'm not nauseous anymore. Um, the metallic taste, I still taste it faintly, but it's nowhere like it was. Like, very, very, very faintly. But, my joints and stuff are hurting so bad, I barely can lift my right arm. Um, that could be because of a number of things. I've lost a lot of weight, and my arms is already big, and so now it's like skin hanging. So, I don't know if that's too much weight. So, I've had to take pain pills. I haven't had to take pain pills none this time I've been doing the treatment. Um, I had to take pain medication. Oh, it's time for me to take my other meds while I'm talking. But anyway, and then I'm going to shower because what is something about the shower? Lord, if it wasn't for the shower and sniffing essential oils, ginger ale, and crackers, I don't know where I would be right now. Like, I swear ginger ale need to sponsor me because I can't even go anywhere without a ginger ale. I can be up the street and tell them, turn around. I got to go back home and give me a ginger ale because it's been some days my indigestion and stuff has been so strong. That's the only thing that has helped me. Like, seriously, it would be so strong like something is stuck here and I would drink the ginger ale and it would allow me to burp. And I'm good. Like, I seriously don't know where I would be without ginger ale. Like, that's, that's crazy. But anyway, um, what I'm experiencing now, I had a really bad headache yesterday. Like I told y'all on my last vlog, I'm not a headache person. So when I have a headache, it just throws everything out because it felt like my head was so heavy. Then my arms and shoulders are hurting real bad. Um, so the doctor was like, check your blood pressure. My blood pressure is perfect. So usually, you know, when your arms and headache, they be like, make sure you're not having a stroke. Make sure you're not having a heart attack. My blood pressure is perfect. So at this point, I'm just trying to weather the storm. I got four more days to go on this bullshit. Um, my stomach is not hurting anymore. That's a good thing. My stomach... Like, my stomach was feeling like it was shredding in the inside at first. But it's good now. And, um, yeah, I'm just like, come on, Rainbow. Come on, Rainbow. Please, at the end of this storm. Because, like, I just text Nicole at work and I, I told her I'm not trying to scare you. But I barely can move my right arm. Like, I seriously can't. So, um... I'm going to put across the screen right now while I'm talking. Um, what they said was also H. pylori. I've been saying H. pylori, but it's H. pylori. <laughs> um, Hel Helicobascus pylori, something shit, some bullshit. But um, it will, should be on the screen right now. Like the other symptoms you have that are digestive, like memory fog and joint and muscle pains and i am feeling that joint and muscle pain so bad i think it's it has to do with me laying around so much but back, i've been so sleepy and drowsy that's all i can do so i'm gonna try to get up and get my blood flowing and my muscles pumping i mean not muscles pumping but y'all know what i'm talking about and i had an appointment to get an iv at three i ain't gonna make it i can't drive one on i mean i could but i'm not um, so I need to call them right now because I was going to go get IV therapy so I don't get dehydrated. That's another thing I'm worried about. But I'm just going to keep drinking my Pedialyte, Gatorade, and water because I, I can't drive way out there by myself. So that's an update as of today. Um, you know, I, my arm is like hurting so bad and it's the right one. If it was the left one, I would definitely be at the hospital because that's the side your heart is on. But... I mean, I know either one, but I'm, I'm just so used to stuff like this, y'all. I, it's I just weather it out. Like the doctors actually fuss at me when I go to the hospital. They're like, "You was in pain in your shoulders and stuff, in your chest, two days. Do you know if you was having a heart attack the six, the first six hours is what saved you?" And I'm like, 
bitch, if I run to the ER every time I'm having chest pains, y'all are thinking something wrong with me. It was so bad. Nicole was sitting out in the car, and she called in the hospital like, I don't know who y'all sending in that room, but they don't need to send him no more because you ain't finna talk to her like that because he was rude with it. So, yeah, I've talked enough. Five minutes. That's all, folks. I'll be back later and let y'all know how I'm feeling. I thought by now I'll be able to start working. No. So tonight, Sugar Nicole is going to have to go to the warehouse because I got some orders up there that need to go out. Y'all know I usually send orders the same day. I'm down right now. I got stuff that needs to restock. I'm down right now. I actually have the stuff, but I'm not going to put it on the website and generate all them sales and I can't work like this. So I'm sorry. I'll try my best Monday. And yeah that's today okay while i'm at it if you didn't watch part one of this it's vlog style but they got other things in it but the end gives you very detailed information about h polyuri gastritis irritable bowel syndrome gerd like all that ties together you get what i'm saying and the foods and stuff you eat are the same and i have a what you eat in a day coming too but girl i can't get out the bed so Listen, y'all, let me tell you what you need to do to prevent this. Because in a million gazillion years, I would never think I would be sitting here with something eating the lining of my small intestines from something I ate. Disclaimer, not disclaimer, what the hell I'm talking about. Heads up, I do know how I got this. Uh, I'm not comfortable sharing it yet. Maybe next vlog or maybe at the end of this vlog. Um, But no, I'm finna share it. Um. I got it when I went to Jamaica right before the pandemic. So you guys know last year before we shut down, I really had somewhere to go every month out of the country. Dead ass. I'm like, I'm finna live. Glad I had the mentality because since then I've been not living. I mean, Lord, forgive me. I don't want to say that. I've been sick. So um, it was something that I ate or drunk. Um while I was in Jamaica, which is weird because I'm going to do a back play of a clip. Okay, eat breakfast and get dressed because I got to do my makeup because my pictures and stuff come out so much better when I'm naked. Like, I'm sorry, y'all. Like, I got to do my pictures and stuff come out so much better when I'm naked. Like, I don't Nothing wrong with other countries. But our water is not, I mean, our stomach is not used to their water. Even though brush your teeth. Right. So I'm the main person. Don't drink their water. Don't brush my teeth with bottled water and everything. And I still got this mess. Um, How do I know it came from there? Because I had just came from Mexico twice. <laughs> yeah, twice. I went to Mexico in October. The end of October. Very end. I went to Mexico in January. <laughs> I went to Jamaica in February, but how I know it came from February, I mean, Jamaica is I sent out a, um, a text message to the person who I went with. It was 21 of us on that trip. And I said, um, Hey, I got this. The doctor tracked it back to the last time I was feeling good or when I first started feeling these symptoms and blah, blah, blah. And they said somebody else already had it months ago. So I, I don't understand why that person didn't sit out a disclaimer. Maybe they didn't know they had it from Jamaica. To give us the heads up, I wouldn't have to fight this shit for so long. Soon as I had already been having digestive problems and stuff. So as soon as someone would have told me somebody else had it on their trip, I would have went straight to the doctor and asked for a test. Let's not talk about that anymore because that gets me kind of in an uproar because that makes me scared to travel now. I, I, that makes me not understand people because, sis, why you didn't tell us that? Sis or bro, because I ain't trying to put nobody out there. I don't, you know, want to disclose no information. But, um, yeah, so let me tell you what to do to avoid this, according to Google and my doctor. Um, <clears throat> I've watched another YouTuber I, it's really hard to find black people who um have H. pylori. She's a mukbanger. One of you guys recommended she had it. And she was saying how harsh the treatment was, and she gave it to her husband. So her husband had to get treated so they don't just keep giving it back and forth to each other. So it can be transmitted through saliva, kissing, obviously, tongue kissing. I'm probably not a little, but like, yeah, 
You get what I'm saying? Oral sex. Um, contaminated food. Contaminated water. That's about it. So, one of you guys have a business. I don't know. I can't remember if I showcased it in my small, one of my small black business halls or just like a hall. Um, I think it's pronounced Astral, Astral Angelica. She sells like bath salts and soap and um, sage sticks and amethyst stones, you know, stuff to get the energy out your house, which Bay has been trying to like Bay serious, y'all. I think I showed y'all the last vlog. I got some sage from Naturalistic Beauty Con, but this person has like a whole bunch of different types. Anyway, she was so kind, guys. So I'm going to leave her link below. Support her, please. If you got to just go on there and buy the cheapest thing, because I understand it's a pandemic. Funds are low and stuff for some people. Support her because I just got a cash up out the blue. And it said um for, what did it say? Oh, for crackers and ginger ale. Right when I was talking about ginger ale. Oh my gosh, that just that just floored me. That just floored me. Cause for one, I was just talking about that. Oh, this shit feel like it weighed two hundred pounds. And for two, it's just some people are just so sweet, guys. So I don't need any money, y'all. So I don't. If I ever need some, I'll let y'all know. But I don't need any money. So. I invested it back into her business times two. Um, yeah, but I just want to say thank you so much on camera that made my day. You're such a sweetheart. I I really, really, really appreciate it. I really, really do. Um, and I hope your business go far. Yeah, I haven't checked in all day. I ain't shit to say though. Yeah. I have been so hungry today. There ain't nothing else happening. This appetite waking back up. Like it's dinner time and I couldn't even wait on sugar to finish. I'm like, can you just bring me a couple of wings? Look. Nicole was just talk so much shit if she saw that wing. Because she one of them type of people that leave all that damn meat on her bone. Tell me to come in how you eat the chicken wings, man. And the cubby like, I don't want to bite too close to the bone. But I'm like, girl, that's like... Five, six bites still left on their chicken wings. I so give this video a big thumbs up. The haters been on me. I don't know why. I ain't doing nothing but being sick in every vlog. And you know that. So don't watch it. I don't know. This YouTube thing is weird because you have people who will watch your whole video and then comment stuff they don't like. But you don't sit here and watch the whole thing. What is you watching for? And it ain't just me. I watch everybody's vlogs and everybody said the same thing. People be pointing out shit in their vlogs and stuff. And it's just like you do know you have the option to click it or not. Like this is what we do every day. So what is there not to like about it is what I did. <laughs> Ooh. Alexa, Q, why you so obsessed with me by Mariah Carey? Jesus. Let me see that chicken bone you just put in. Oh, she bad. Oh, shoot. Look at Poo Poo. At the trap. The girl. I got to stop this. Them things hanging low. <laughs> Give me a uh, blue face mask from up there, please, honey child. Go through and jack on these chairs. Have to get a few orders out, y'all. Very few. Hey, guys. So, uh, I'm finally working on restocks. I sent Nicole to get glasses because I am so all the way out on the website. And, y'all, I'm just laughing so hard because... <laughs> It's a struggle. We trying to be on FaceTime. I'm having to tell her to bag out. She like on the stuff like this. <laughs> Do you know how I be blurring on FaceTime? And I'm trying to see the new styles. And ugh. But she made it happen, y'all. She made it happen. So by the time this vlog low, there will be a lot, a lot, a lot of glasses um, restocked and added to the stock site a lot of them i'm not able to restock right now so i push them to the end until they get in 
and put all the ones that are in stock at the top. And um, I'm working on restocking Come To Me by Nikki. I can't even lie, you guys. I have the stuff. I just don't have the energy to go through it and put it up. And I have to be the one that do that to make sure my inventory and stuff is right. Because sometimes these vendors be messing up. But, um, yeah. I just ate. But my stomach was feeling horrible. All I had was oatmeal and apples. So I had to go to the restroom. So I had to put something back on my stomach to take the medicine in like 20 minutes. So, yeah. They say things get worse before they get better. Because I thought by week two, I'm on. Um, this all I got left, y'all. One, two, three more days. Look like it. After today, I'll have two full days down here. This is tonight. And then these two. And I'll be done. So I thought by now, baby, I'd be ready to uh go to the club. But <laughs> that's a different side effect every goddamn day. So um, I got some necklaces and earrings and bracelets coming in for y'all, though. And they're going to be real cheap. Y'all going to love it. All right. All right, guys. So, we got some CC necklaces and gold and silver. Got them in the round. This is more like a, it's not a square. It's a um, rectangle um, and oval. And then the earrings and the rectangle. The small earrings in the circle. The big earrings in the circle. Um, and some blinged out bracelets. So yeah, I got these. Y'all know what these are duping. I kind of want to keep a pair myself, but y'all. <laughs> I don't need no more sunglasses like that. And I got them in black too. They're a tad bit smaller in black though. Just a tad bit. I know I got my glasses back in stock. He had a lot, a lot of pair for me, but I haven't been able to get over there in a week. So, and I had to send the code today. So a lot of them have sold. So I have plenty and I have other boxes. Um, I got them in black and tortoise and I also got them back in brown. Here's a box of the tortoise ones love these glasses i um actually sent in the brown pair and the tortoise pair to get prescribed like my black ones are because i love this style so much i mean they make life so easy just put them on some lip gloss your brows aren't showing none of that and you good here's brown baby in the package it doesn't do these any justice hold on Ooh, <laughs> so well y'all see me in these everybody go on them they are so fly. God dang. I was able to get a very small amount of the Mayas back in stock. Um, the tortoise, the black, and here's a new style. These and another shade. Y'all love, love these. Hold up, I'm trying to turn the light up. That's like the bronzy. And then the back is more like brown. I didn't let it pick up. There we go.